Goodbye, April. Hello, May. Hi, everybody. On this last day of the month, although it seems like November, this is Trivia Treats. 19 years ago, a 31 to 1 underdog in the 19 horse field, Charismatic, won the 125th running of the Kentucky Derby at Churchill Downs in Louisville, Kentucky. Then two weeks later, on May 15th, Charismatic will also win the Preakness at 8 to 1 odds. And two weeks after that, on June 5th, in a quest for the Triple Crown, Charismatic will be a 2 to 1 favorite and take the lead in the final furlong. However, Charismatic will then break a leg and wound up in third place with 29 to 1 underdog Lemon Drop Kid the winner. Also, 16 years ago in 2002, Robert Horry sank a three-pointer with two seconds left on a pass from Kobe Bryant to give the Lakers a 92-91 victory over the Trailblazers at the Rose Garden in Portland. The win completed a 3-0 sweep of Portland in the best of five Western Conference playoff series. Staying with the NBA playoffs, nine years ago today, in 2009, the Bulls outlasted the defending champion Celtics 128-127 in triple overtime at the United Center in Chicago in game six of the final round of the NBA playoff. It was the fourth overtime game of the series and the third in a row. Bulls rookie guard Derrick Rose scored 28 points and John Salomon's hit for 35 while Ray Allen tallied 51 for Boston. The Celtics won game seven two days later in Boston. Turning to baseball. 15 years ago, in 2003, the Cardinals were victorious in a 20-inning 7-6 marathon against the Florida Marlins in Miami during a game that lasted six hours and seven minutes. And finally, on the day after tomorrow, May 2nd, 1939, 79 years ago, Yankee first baseman Lou Gehrig voluntarily ended his streak of consecutive games played at 2,130 by sitting out a game against the Detroit Tigers at Brick Stadium in Detroit. Through eight games in 1939, Gehrig was batting just 143 and struggling on defense. Babe Dahlgren relieved him at first base, and the Yankees won that day 22-2. One month later in 39, the Iron Horse was diagnosed with amyotrophic lateral cirrhosis, commonly known today as ALS, which is now known as Lou Gehrig's disease. He will die of the ailment on June 2nd, 1941, at the age of 37. Gehrig's streak will be declared unbreakable, but Cal Ripken Jr. will surpass it by playing in 2,632 consecutive games. That's 502 more for the Orioles from 1982 through 1998. Now his record has certainly been declared unbreakable. Till Friday. Be a good sport and stay loose.